All right, folks, we are back and we're going to be heading off to deal with the final three Fee blood bosses in Act Four, I believe. That is Solaris, the Immaculate, Talzer, the Winged Horror, and Adam, the Firstborn. Now, as I mentioned in the last video, I believe this one, people have said that this one's going to give me trouble. So, looking forward to seeing how we match up against them. But first, we're going to deal with Talzer first. A creature that was once one of Dracula's favorite pets. The monster mourned the death of its master in a blood-soaked vigil, enduring the toxic, bloody rains that followed Dracula's death for seven days and seven nights. Unlike the many creatures that suffered under the rains, this one embraced agony. Through its love and devotion for the tyrant king, it was able to embrace all the hatred passed down through the downpours, curse, and become the winged horror. So we'll get a pedestal of the winged horror, which is a pedestal that may hold a soul shard. Okay, so it's like a trophy case or a trophy holder or whatever. I don't know. We'll see. Then we get this, a soul shard of the winged horror, which is what appeared on the thing that we've gotten a couple of videos back. I think it was this thing over here. Eye of Twilight. So it's one of the three jewels. Amulets or whatever. Shards? I mean, not jewels. Shards. One, two, three. Okay, so I believe the winged ho oh. Is that is that over there? Or is it this is this something separate? Alright, in any case, we're gonna head over there to where Talzer is at. I did do some upgrades in between the session and the last one. I've gotten the Black Hand Skull Taker, which is a 30, level 30 sword, as well as the Crack Shot Bolt Storm, which is also a level 30 crossbow. So that pushed us up to 87 gear level, so we are more than enough, I believe, more than enough able to take care of that creature. So they're this way. So yeah, they will be here then. I don't know what I'm going to be expecting with this creature, but... I will assert my will. I believe it'll be at least fun, hopefully. From beyond, return to my side. Oh. We also get uh, the ability to make Dracula's gloves. Which is definitely an upgrade for us for sure. Okay, that way. Wait, why is it pointing that way if... Oh, it is... Okay, never mind. I'm good. I am good. I'm wondering how much more, how more powerful we'll be once we get that shard. Oh, we must, we probably got to fly for this dreaded peak. Okay. That's why we had the bat form. Oh. I'm glad it's nighttime too. Oh. I think it's the same creature we saw back in the other place. I think it's ugly. All right. Well, we'll do distance for this because it most likely can fly, as you can see with wings, obviously. Let's do this. Come here. Come on, scrub. Oh! Shit. All right. I'm gonna watch what it does. Okay. What's it doing? Where is it at? Okay. Oh, it's aiming it for them. That's fine. Come on down here, buddy. Come on, scrub. Does that twice, I think, right? Or three times? Oh, shit. Killed it already? Okay. I did not mean to dash that quick. Oh, I, 
got hit by that. Do that. That actually works out for us. Gonna come over here. Ow. Ooh, that was so close. Let's just take one of these. Wait till he comes back down where I put the Death Knight out. Oh no. Does it three times? Okay, nope. It's only twice. Need him to come over here. There we go. What? Uh. Shit, shit. Come to charge me. I think I'm good to. Oh, that sucks at that. Those healing balls disappear. I was like, what are you doing? Oh no. Hey, he's flying. So we do some bombs. Good. Where's he gonna land? Shit. Where are you landing? It's over here. Let's do this. That in there. Ah, uh, it's whatever. Punk! First try. Easy. That was fun. It's just basically staying away from him. Luckily, of course, we have the crossbow, which was great against us. Just staying out of the crap that he put out. I feel All stronger. right. Soul Shard of the Wing Horror. Nice. Just in time to leave. Let me take that rat too. For food for ours. Prisoners. I need to get in the shade real quick. All right, so we got this soul shard. It's the same level as what we have equipped, though, but it has 50%, 15% spell critical strike chance, as opposed to what we have equipped has reduced blood drain rate by 50%. But it has a couple of things that we can. It's probably best to use against Dracula because it has 15% damage to vampires. Also, 20% chance to primary on primary hit to trigger chaos explosion igniting on nearby enemies and replaces your ultimate ability with void quake vortex. Okay, the heck is a void quake vortex? Okay, void quake vortex disappear from this plane of existence and appear again in the target location in a violent explosion dealing 400% magic damage inflicting ignite and pulling enemies towards the center of the vortex. Gain power surge when appearing again. That's cool. 
Okay, we'll, we'll keep this equipped for now. All right, so Solaris the Immaculate, a legendary paladin of the light and the oldest living member of the Church of Luminance. He has watched firsthand the descent of mankind with disinterest. A pioneer from the age of heroes, he remembers the struggle of facing down Dracula's armies until all hope was lost. He remembers finding a light. He remembers the, dis the satisfaction of lifting his holy blade to the mortal king and striking down the greatest evil the world has ever seen. He yearns to return to the days where he knew glory. And I believe he has to be in Silver Lake or Silver Silver Light. It's probably in here. Yep, definitely there. All right, so on the way there, I'm going to head back to the castle. All right, let's see what's materials we need for this these gloves oh what we have four different versions okay color schemes shadow gloves dread gloves grim gloves and malef Mal maleficer am i saying it right maleficer gloves okay maleficer gloves have spell crit strike chance and spell power this one's physical power and damage reduction this is weapon attack and life as skill life leech. So I think for us, since we mostly are a distance, I don't really use shield. So dread gloves are out of the question right now. I might do the Maleficer gloves. That's a spell leech. Or See the shadow gloves. Shadow gloves is more crit strike. Crit strike could be good for our bow. Crossbow. Also has attack leech. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Increases max health by 130. Veal attacks heal for 2%. Additional max health and gains 10% attack speed three seconds after using veal. I don't use veal. I don't believe it's Either the scholar gloves or the sh Malef Maleficer gloves Actually shadow gloves are, too, are good too. I might do a shadow gloves Was it a crit strike? Increase Or our spell it's the only spells we use all right. Anyway, regardless, I need nine shadow weave and nine bat leather. I could, I think I have the bat leather. All right. We got our gloves. How do you look? Look pretty sexy. Adjust the color. Which is good to know. I want to make them more so match what I'm wearing. There we go. Yeah, I like this. I like this look a lot. Let's head off deal with Solaris, shall we? All right, now we are finally ready to move forward with this. Actually take a potion. Had to make a quick detour because I needed to get some holy resistance potion. I only made one. I could make another one if needed, but I think 60 minutes is enough attempts to like kill this guy. And again, we might fight him once and uh, kill him. So glad it's nighttime. I don't want to use a healing potion right now. I want to save it for this fight. Fuck. Okay, it's probably another one coming up. Another group. Yep. They have muskets. Them right now. All right, let's take this potion and let me heal up. Oh, this is a fabulous looking place. And I'm assuming he's on that platform. Oh my god, this looks crazy. <laughs> Blood sustains me. All right. 
We got this. I don't know if I should go melee or... I'm gonna do range for now. Wow. Wow, look at this place. All right, dude. Ready to die? Let's do this. There are still some of you rats left. Yes, sit. Excuse you. I'll slay you all. Oh my God. Oh God. Okay. Okay. All right. Join. The fuck? This is luminance. Shit! 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 God. Oh! Holy shit. This guy's no joke. You know what? Fuck it. Get that heal. What was that? The divine angel? Shit, I gotta kill that thing. Most likely. Jesus Christ, there's so much shit on his screen. This is this angel has a lot of health, too. Maybe I need to avoid, like, just um, ignore the angel because. He's like almost dead at this point. Okay. Or maybe I'll switch to melee. I don't know. Let's, let's go, dude. I will strike you down like this. Maybe I should have put the shield on. I already knocked them over almost at 50 percent. It pelted. Your end is The knock on. God damn. Just, oh, he's healing. Fuck. Okay, I can take her out now. Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on, die. Oh, what happened? Oh, she's on our side now? Okay. This is God. Okay. 
Oh god! Oh god! He's dead now. Cause he's dead too, bitch. That was dope. That was a dope fight. Give me that blood, please. So it was only like two tries. Hell yeah. Alright, Onyx tier. Take that stuff too. That's created. Skeleton charm. All right. What did we get of his? 10% chance on primary hit to spawn a death knight. We already do spawn a death knight. So you can spawn two death knights. Replace your ultimate ability with fallen angel. Oh, wait, what? Let me try to see. Yes, I will embrace this power. What's that do? Summons a fallen angel to fight for you for 15 seconds. Attacks performed by the fallen angel inflicts condemned. Oh, oh, that mixed with the death knight and then you can summon another one on top of that. I don't know if I, I think this is too much for, I could probably. Uh, I'll keep it on for now. All right, so that's it for act four. Now, however, do oh, I can make Dracula's boots too? I don't know if I have enough. I don't think I have enough materials to make it. Adam the Firstborn. The culmination of Dr. Henry's Black Bruce brilliance, the monster was to be the next step in human evolution. The ultimate machine of war. It is as powerful as Black Brew has ever desired, but proved impossible to control. The Transcendum has done everything it can to contain the monster, and they've been successful in doing so. For now. Okay. Okay, so where are you at? Good sir. Wait. He's that way? Right? It's that way. So then. Oh, he's in this gate. Oh, I remember seeing that. Okay. I remember seeing that gate a long time ago. I was like. What the heck is behind there? And that gate is open too. So they locked him in this prison back here. What? High voltage protection. Huh? What? Can't I just fly over this? Hold on, let me see. Um, holding a soul shard. Okay. Maybe creating an EMP would do it. I've never made one before, but. Alright, how does this. EMP work. Oh, oh, okay. That's cool. Can I use it? Oh. I think I might have screwed up. I think I placed it close, too close to the wall. God damn it! Can I just shoot it? Oh fuck. Nice. All right, Adam, where are you? Take out my great sword. Oh, it's okay, it's two of them. Hey, this guy must be just extremely powerful to be locked up in this place like this. 